okay ah uh, this is the these four questions are the thing that you need to do with the class that you already created actually from what we have done from one to ten we don't even can, cannot run we just create a class so we need to use it the first one created instead of bank of you uh, let I, I'll go for it because I don't want to change any value anymore let I don't know Bangkok BU students equal to can be any name nah? equal to Bangkok University student and you need to pass the you need to pass information there um, university name Bangkok Bangkok University and what next what next what next a student name student name let's say I am a student okay and student age let's say my age is 26 oh 26 good next call print student info method <laughs> bu student dot print student info method ah, okay and then call will share need method bu student dot will share need method and then call gpa method uh, bu student dot gpa health but for gpa you need to pass pass the variable let's say my grade is only 1.6 okay 1.6 okay one uh, 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 sorry. Uh, GPA health of my student class is wrong. Run. Huh. Oh, okay. This is my bad. I'm always confused. So, in order to call method, like in Swift, you need something like this GPA is 1.6. Okay. Ah. Mintra is a student from Bangkok U. This is come from Prim Student Info, right? Um, Prim Student Info, yep. Mintra is a student from Bangkok U. Mintra is happy. Mintra can walk to the class. This is come from Wilshire Needed. Ah. Mintra is happy because my age is less than 60. Lastly, about my GPA. My GPA is 1.6. So this is go to GPA Health of Bangkok U. It doesn't go to GPA Health of Student. So my GPA is below than the threshold, so it needs to print keep your grade up be your student. Alright, that's perfect. So what you need to do, could you please continue to create another class for Stanford University student and try to complete all of them. Upload your file to the blackboard and yeah, boom, done. Thank you.